Whoa. Whoa! Whoa! What were you doing? I owed my girl buddy a solid. Isn't that a redeeming quality? Helping friends with stuff? Not with turf wars that result in territorial genocide. Eh, you win some, you lose a few hundred. <laughs> it wasn't that bad anyway. Oh, come on, I had to. My credibility was on the line. I mean, what kind of reputation would I have if people found out I was trying to go clean? It just throws out my entire persona. Your credibility? What about- No, no, no! Babe, jokes are funny. I made you look, uh, sad and pathetic. Like an orphan with no arms or legs. Uh, oh, with- Progeria! Great, now I'm bummed thinking about it. Does this thing have any liquor? Can you please just try to take this seriously? Fine, I'll try. Just don't get your taco in a twist, baby. Was that you trying to be sexist or sexist? Whatever pisses you off more. Is there seriously no liquor in here? I'm gonna kill him. Too late, toots. Wait, would that make me double dead? <laughs> Where exactly do I go? To double hell? <laughs> Sorry, you're stuck with me, bitch. Shave me, Mufasa. Here, I'll get used to it. Listen, who cares if some Jagoffs got hurt? Most of them are ugly freaks. Look around. You got a bunch of fucking Harlequin babies down you're here. You're one to talk? Hey, this body is flawless. Oh. Everyone wants some of me, and I got the creepy fan that is to prove it. <laughs> Sweetheart, quite a pleasure. Excuse my sudden visit, but I saw your fiasco on the picture show, and I just couldn't resist. Whoa! Why, I haven't been that entertained since the stock market crash of 1929. <laughs> so many orphans. Stop right there. God, we're all equal. There. I know what you're doing. And I'm not going to let you hurt anyone here. You caught this cheesy talk show shit, Marty. Dear, if I wanted to hurt anyone here, I would have done. Now, I'm here because I want to help! Say what now? Help! <laughs> Hello? Is this thing on? Testing? Testing? Testing! Well, I heard you loud and clear! Um, you want to help? We with... This ridiculous thing you're trying to do! This hotel! I want to help you run it! But... <laughs> Why does anyone do anything? Sheer, absolute boredom! I've lacked inspiration for decades. My work became mundane, lacking focus. Aimless! I've come to crave a new form of entertainment! <laughs> does getting into a fist fight with a reporter count as entertainment? <laughs> it's the purest kind, my dear. Reality! True passion! After all, the world is a state, and the state is a world of entertainment. So, does this mean that you think it's possible to rehabilitate a demon? <laughs> of course not! That's whack! Redemption! Oh, the non-existent humanity! No, 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 no! I don't think there's anything left that could save such loathsome sinners! The chance given was the life they lived before! The punishment is this! There is no undoing what is done! So then, why do you want to help me if you don't believe in my cause? Considered an investment in ongoing entertainment for myself! I want to watch the scum of the world struggle to climb up the hill of betterment, only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fiery pit of failure. Yes, indeedy. I see big things coming your way, and who better to help you than I? Uh, so, say, so, say, so, say, so. Uh, what's the deal with smiles over there? Wait, you've never heard of him before? You've been here longer than me. 
The radio demon, one of the most powerful beings Hell has ever seen. Eh, not big on politics. Ugh. Decades ago, Alistair manifested in Hell. Alistair manifested in Hell. You began to topple overlords who had been dominant for centuries. Dominant. That kind of raw power had never been harnessed by a mortal so Then, he broadcast his carnage all throughout Hell. Just so everyone could witness his journey. Everyone could witness his journey. started calling him. He looks like a strawberry pimp. Well, I don't trust him. Uh, to be fair, do you trust any man? Any men? <laughs> men. Charlie, listen to me. You believe this creep? He is just a happy face. He's a deal maker. Pure evil. He can't be redeemed. And is most likely looking for a way to destroy everything we're trying to do. I... Uh, we don't know that. Uh, look, I know he's bad, and I know he's bad, and... But the whole point of this is to give people a chance. To have faith, things will be better. How can I turn someone away? I can't. It goes against everything I'm trying to do. Everything I believe in. Just trust me. I can't take care of myself. Charlie, whatever you do, do not make a deal with him. Don't worry. I picked up one thing from my dad. You don't take sh from other demons. Okay, so, Al, you're sketchy as fuck, and you clearly see what I'm trying to do here as a joke. But I don't. I think everyone deserves a chance to prove they can be better, so I'm taking your offer to help. On the condition that there be no trickster voodoo strings attached. So, uh, it's a deal then? Nelly, that's no- <laughs> No shaking, no deals. I... Hmm. As princess of hell and heir to the throne, I, uh, hereby order that you help with this hotel for as long as you desire. Sound fair? Hmm. Fair enough. Cool beans. <laughs> Spoil, my dear! You know you're never fully dressed without one! So where is your hotel staff? Uh, well... Oh, you're going to need more than that. And what can you do, my effeminate anime fellow? I can suck a your dick. Ha! Ah, maybe. Well, this just won't do. I suppose I can cash in a few favors to liven things up. Boys, oh. Hell? What the fuck is this? Oh, uh, husks, uh, husks, uh, husks, uh, husks, husker, my good friend. Glad you could make it. It can be shot. Don't you husker me, you son of a bitch. I was about to win the whole damn pot. Good to see you two. What the hell do you want with me this time? My friend, I am doing some charity work, so I took it upon myself to volunteer your services. I hope that's okay. Are you shitting me? Hmm. No, I don't think so. You thought it would be some kind of big fucking riot just to pull me out of nowhere? You think I'm some kind of fucking clown? Maybe. I ain't doing no fucking charity job. Well, I figured you would be the perfect face to man the front desk of this fine establishment. With your charming smile and welcoming energy, this job was made for you. Don't worry, my friend. I can make this more welcoming. If you wish. What? You think you can buy me with a wink and some cheap booze? Well, you can! Hey, 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 hey! No, no bar, no alcohol. 
This is supposed to be a place that discourages sissy sh Not some kind of now brothel mint. <laughs> Hey. Go fuck yourself. Only if you watch me. Oh my gosh! Welcome to the Happy Hotel! You are going to love it here! I lost the ability to love years ago. What do you think? This is amazing! It's okay. <laughs> this is going to be very entertaining! <laughs> Jambalaya! I keep thinking about you and I can't get you out of my...